Every morning on Spice FM, we have four hours of a talk show. Mm. And many times we ask people, even those who come to the show, to tell us what is it that the nation is saying when we are seeing people out on the streets. And many of them, even when we said that we're coming, you have invited us to come and have this conversation this evening, they said, tell the president that he's tone deaf. And we ask why and how. And they say, when William Ruto took over as president, he took over a budget of 3.2 trillion shillings. He went to parliament and he said, honorable speakers, I believe that this budget is too high. We should cut it by 300 billion shillings. So you believed barely one and a half years ago that you can run the country with 2.9 billion shillings, trillion shillings. Barely a few months, you went to parliament and requested to spend 3.6 trillion shillings. This year, you went to parliament and initially requested to spend 4.2 trillion shillings. And what do they see in return? They see extravagance in government. They see a government that is pushing gung-ho to employ new people called CASs. They see a government that is purchasing new motor vehicles and trips that are extravagant. They see opulence with those that are close to the president appearing in public carrying wads of cash. They see condescending attitude from those who serve in this government when they're asked, why are you spending? And they respond the way they respond. Your advisors speaking the same. And so they see a government where the president is telling people, we are going to live within our means. We are all going to tighten our belts. We have austerity. They end up with their children not going to school because for months, JS teachers are on strike. They end up with, right now, 91 days where clinical officers have not been to work. <clears throat> 91 days, Mr. President. We ended up with intern doctors going on strike for weeks because the government says it has no money. We end up with people going to the hospitals and there's no medicine. We end up with people who are being told that we don't have money to pay salaries or we don't have money to pay salaries and also uh, have a development. Yet, they see all this extravagance and opulence from those in power. You are tone deaf, Mr. President, that's what they say. Well, I guess that's why we must have a conversation. That's why we must have a conversation. And I'm very happy for us to have this conversation so that we can put the facts on the table and we can all of us make a decision. But let me tell you the following. I've listened to you and um, let me also tell you that 